what they gotta do. Come on, boys. You wanna try me? Stay I'm in like, the blue box. No, hold on. Stay in the blue box. You, you wanna taste me? No. Do it. Stay in the I blue like box. It. I like it, Kinky. Stay in the blue box, Grace. I don't know what they call when I get to the station. They will let you get numbers of friends and everything out of your phone. I don't have anybody. Please. You were just at a friend's house. <laughs> When suspects try to avoid charges or detention, they sometimes resort to flirtation and seduction to persuade the authorities to release them. Here are some cases where such behavior was observed, starting with Case 1. In April 2023, Grace Spoonamore, a 20-year-old exotic dancer, made headlines after a chaotic encounter with the Brunswick Police Department in Ohio. Who else is in the car? Who else is in the car? Stop! Don't get out! I'm asking you questions, you answer. Okay, and I will answer. Why did you get on me like that? 26 at quarters, it's a female. Alright, step out. A white step female. Out. Put your hands behind your back. Put your hands behind your back. Why did you take off like that? I'm sorry. Drinking or something? No. Where are you coming from? Brunswick. Come on. Can you stop pulling me like that? Nope. Do you have anything in your pockets? Oh yeah? Oh yeah? <laughs> oh, I don't know. You want to check me? Touch me real quick. It may feel intervised. All right, stop. Sitting there. No, you don't want to stop. Are you on something right now? No. I just came for dinner with my trick. How much you have to drink there? Two doubles. Two doubles of what? Patron. Okay. So you are drunk. And I'm gonna keep it up up with you. Where's the owner of that vehicle? I don't know. Who's Don to Smith? I just bought it. All right. <clears throat> Another officer's on the way. He's gonna be dealing with the crash. I got this OBI, so. You all right though, no injury? Um, are you injured? No. Do you need EMS? No. Okay. okay. I need to talk to you. What? Don't hit me with a what? What do you need? Don't try me because I used to be a paramedic. Okay. Following a car crash while allegedly intoxicated and assaulting an officer by spitting on him during the traffic stop, Spoonamore's actions took an unusual turn. She initially denied drinking but later confessed to consuming three doubles of tequila. Throughout the ordeal, officers labeled her as drunk multiple times. What do you mean? You want to stand up? No. No? No. You got to make it hot before it comes. Okay. Once Did you just comes, move here from Georgia? Yes. Okay, how long have you been up in Cleveland? Like, maybe a year. Why'd you move up here? Because I didn't know it was a snow and it's cold. <laughs> What's a good phone number for you? 706. I don't like talking to you between these bars. Can I talk to you in person? You are talking to me in person. No, I'm not. I'm talking to you between bars right now. You want to Okay. That? What's your current address right now? Where are you staying? Don't worry about all that. What's your current... Well, I need your current address. No, I'm not giving it to you. You need to give me your current address right now. And what do you want to do if I don't? I'm going to charge you, you with obstructing. Constructing what? Obstructing official business. What is okay, your address? Okay, that's cool. Address? I don't care. What is your current address? I don't care. I'm not giving you my current address. So I was spending these mean days that I have to do. Do you want to give that to him? I'll try it. 
getting this info. Alright. Just to switch it up, I guess. Uh, I guess. What's that? You. What about me? I'm guessing we'll give you whatever you gotta do to a structure. Just the, uh, egg. OH3? Yeah, please. Right. I give him a victim right now. That's okay. That's my vehicle. Why are you yelling at me? You ain't got shit. Because I'm yes. not shit. You're I'm not shit related to Cleveland. I'm not shit related to Columbus, Ohio. No, no, None no. of that. Okay. Well, let me tell you. I'm here upon business. What's your name? Grace. Grace, what's your name? G-R-A-C. Do you ever have an Ohio license or just a Georgia one? I have never had an Ohio license because I didn't get the chance. That's okay, I'm on that. No. What about, are you staying in Ohio now? Yes. Where do you stay at? Don't worry about that. So here's the thing, Grace. I don't care. You will though, because if we can't figure out who you are or where you stay at, you're, you sit in jail until they fingerprint you and find I out. I'm good. Do it. I don't want to do that. Do it. What's your current address? Are you staying here? And then it's right out exactly what happened, essentially. Heading west Driving mountain, westbound, a vehicle. Okay. Yeah. I was right behind it when it happened, oh too. God. I'm so glad you did. And I saw it. She was barreling. Yeah. And I scooted over to the left. Yeah. And I was like... So believe it or not... The light, we have like license plate readers in the city. Yeah. There's a felony warrant attached to this car. So I was so out were looking for it. Oh, Fortunately, oh. she doesn't have it. It's somebody else. So, oh, but that's what I thought they were taking off for me because of that. Sure. But she's just drunk and stupid. All right, thank you. Hey, guess what? Uh -huh. Your bouncer that works in my club, cause I'm a stripper. At Christie's? Right? No, Where? hustlers. Where's that? What do you mean, what the <laughs> Where is it? Like, where's what the do you mean, where is it? You know. Don't, don't play know. dumb with me. I ain't that dumb. Okay. Don't play me like that. Okay. It's downtown. Okay. That's fine. So, at least seven different officers want to uh, report me mm -hmm. as Because I want to sleep with them. Because I work there. Did she just spit on you? All right, she's going down. We're not gonna test her. Yeah. Let me go. Nope. All right. She's going down for that. Yeah. Um, we're not gonna give her a chance to test. No, of course. Okay. So she clearly isn't going to. Hold on, Grace. No, we'll be with I'm you. I'm not with you, bro. What stood out was Spoonamore's attempt to seduce the arresting officer, referring to him as handsome, and bizarrely asking to be tased because she likes it kinky. Let me off, bro. Let me off, bro. They torture me, bitch. I'd rather be tortured than deal with you by the Mexicans, the Mexican cartel. I'd rather be tortured by them than to deal with you. You wouldn't let me go! Step out. No, you wouldn't let me go. I couldn't hold it. Okay. And I <laughs> okay, I'm coming out more. No, no, shoes. No, shoes. Fuck shoes. Because I already put in the car. Alright. You can have them. I couldn't hold it. Door 22, please. What's your name? Logan? You look like a Logan. No. Go ahead. You gonna let me keep pissing? No, come on. I don't wanna piss through your Come heart. on. Okay. Shit. Bye. Uh, hold on. Door 23. A bacterial infection. Okay, just stand in that blue box. Here. Just stand in that blue box. Whatever. Can I take it off? No, leave it on. Leave it on. Grace, just stop. 
I'm gonna get a female lag here. Well, get it. Just stay there. No, Just stay there. I wanna take them all! Okay! I wanna be my pin! You wanna try me! Stay I'm in worried. the blue box. No, hold on. Stay in the blue box. You Want to taste me? No. Do it. Stay in the I blue like box. It. I like it kinky. Stay in the blue box, Grace. Don't. Stay in the blue box. Step back. You can touch Step me. Step back. You touch me. Just stay in that blue box. No. Look. No. no. Yes. You don't want me here. You don't want me here. Stay in the blue box. No. Get the fuck out of me. Just stay there. Get You didn't catch them. Stay in the blue box. You didn't catch me. Stay in the blue box. You didn't catch me, and you didn't catch them. You go let people slice and dice your community before you let them connect the pieces. Just stay in the blue box. Don't touch me. She? No, I don't need she. She is urinating I everywhere. I Yes, all in the back seat of my don't. car. Yes, I did. All out because there. Because disrespect him. Fuck him. I'm gonna take a test. That's on the, no. Fuck the time. Alright, refusal. Alright. 1918. Right over here. Do you not understand? Yeah. I'm saying. I got you, I got it. I'm saying. I understand. I'm what confessing you're to your piss test. Right, I understand. You understand that? I do, I got it. But y'all didn't. Right, I, I got you. No. Like 23. No, you don't. I don't. No, you don't. Bro. Really? No, you don't, bro. I got you. No, you don't. Stand by for a minute. Hey, hey, no. come stand right here at this window. Stay right here. No! No, y'all wanna rape me! This. Stop! Y'all wanna rape me! Stop! Stop! Stop trying to rape me! Get in the Don't car. Don't put me in the car. Grace? Don't put me in the car. I was stripped outside the car. I was stripped outside the car. Don't put me in the car. Please don't put me in the car. No, 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 no. Watch out for all that. You're trying to put me Grace, in the Mexico. Quiet and get in the car. You're trying to put me in the Mexico. No, we're no, not. Despite her attempts, Spoonamore was arrested and faced charges, including OV, speeding, obstruction of official business, and assaulting a police officer. If you thought that this is considered flirting, wait until you see how Barton was behaving. Case 2. On May 11, 2023, the aftermath of the incident involving Kelly Barton, a 48-year-old Ohio woman, unfolded in a series of events following her alleged DUI crash while transporting a special needs patient, where was reported to have failed sobriety tests at the scene by the Blue Ash Police Department. Client is in the car, and uh, he says she hit a lamp post in the middle of the street. That's what he said. Barton's co-worker says the patient in the vehicle says she hit a lamp post before pulling into a gas station. I've been at work since 7 o'clock this morning, so I don't know if she hit something in the middle or what, but Robert just keeps saying she hit a lamp post. Okay. And she said she had to avoid a hole. I don't know what this is. She shredded the back of that. She's she in the back popped. of my car. Well, she popped both tires, so oh, I'm afraid she hit something in the lash, so... Yep. Uh, I guess it's going to be by the roundabout. Uh, that's what I think too. <laughs> well, you're saying she came Glendale Milford? Yeah, it'd be up. Oh, yeah. Okay, so here's here's what she told me. The driver is in her car. Okay. So I came to an empty vehicle. All right. The owner of this facility or whatever it is, they they. Transport special Car for Nora 32, squad dispatch 106 this driver, for Cinderella this Drive is for 93 year old yes, female, semi conscious. Yeah, for Nora 32. For Nora 32, Clark. Okay. Um, I'm just wondering, since of the OVI charge had a car. Car 7 Nora 32, drive. 7 Nora 33 in the lot of 1705 Lincoln. 
I see a complaint of reference verbal trouble with you know ex boyfriend Sydney Bryan. Barton's co worker then explains she's new to the job and lives in a shelter nearby. I'm we gotta figure out what we're gonna do with her. Do you know where she goes? Yes, yeah, she's down at the. Uh... During the encounter with law enforcement, Barton engaged in numerous attempts to flirt with the first responders on the scene. She repeatedly complimented the officers and EMS workers, calling them handsome and telling them, don't let me get any. Nobody saw her driving. The lady picked her up, said my boss told me to come down here and, and come get her. She, and when she came to find her. So the, the reason they found her is the lady that was driving that's drunk called her boss saying, hey, I need a tow truck because the car I, I hit a pothole and a blue tire. So this lady came to come pick them up and she's like, oh, she's drunk. Officers then approach Barton's co-worker's vehicle. The patient she was transporting, Robert, sits in the front seat as Barton is passed out in the back. It's Robert. He's Robert? Client, yeah. Oh, how are you doing, Robert? Got sketch to it after that. Scratch to match Okay. All right. Where is the driver right there? I'm going to open your back door to see now, okay? Oh. Hello there. Kelly. What's her name? Kelly. Kelly? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kelly? Yes? How are you doing? Good. Kelly, would you be able to, do you have a driver's license with you? You want me to do what, the number? Yeah, if you know it, that'd be great. Barton admits to officers she had too much to drink, but does not admit to driving. Kelly, did you have anything to drink tonight? Yeah. How much? Above my limit. Okay. Were you driving? No. How'd you get here? Because I didn't ever leave. Okay, so you drove out here, or what happened? Officers then brainstorm how to confirm Barton was behind the wheel. So I got her to say pretty much that she had she said I drank over my limits and she gave me her info that she'd been drinking and that's it. So she said no. She said no. She said no. Check camera, see if you see her out of car. Officers do confirm Barton was driving by looking at gas station security video. It's good. She gets out of the car. She gets out of the car. Okay, let's test right. her and that's she fine. goes. Right. And she gets charged with uh I think it's neglect because if he's that dis if he's disabled. And here she comes, and I don't see who the time is. Okay. 20, 30, 18. We'll say 20, 30, 15. And then it's uh, 5 11. Perfect. Thank you, sir. We'll have an investigator come down and get that from you. What time's a good time? Two? All right. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Yeah, let's test her. No, no problem. Yeah, and if she refuses, I think we got, we got plenty. Despite her flirtatious behavior, Barton was arrested for operating a vehicle while impaired. The patient she was transporting confirmed to authorities that Barton was indeed the driver at the time of the incident. Barton's co-worker explained the circumstances of the crash, stating that Barton had hit a lamppost before pulling into a gas station. You gotta come on out, Kelly, okay? I've been super nice, I've been super reasonable with you, but I need you to come out, okay? I need you to get out of this car so that you can take the gentleman home. Okay. Okay? Okay, yeah. He's got to go home. Okay. Just be careful. Just be yeah, careful. Yeah, I'll leave me alone. Put, put your shoes this. on, all right? I'm going to have you to step over here with me. Ma'am, listen, you Relax. need to listen to the officer, okay? Ma'am, do, do, do not do that. Don't call me. I didn't throw you anywhere. We're not, no, relax. 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 I want to talk to you. Okay, so let me go. Okay. I need you to come over here. I just need you to step over here, okay? You got to work with yes, me, Yes, okay? sir. Thank you. Okay. Well, we're, these ambulance people are going to come talk to real fast, okay? Talk to who? To you. Make sure you're okay. Let me ask you this. You check her out here. I don't want to. You ass. Let me ask you this, ma'am. Can I run a series of tests? Can I check your eyes and have you do a couple? Uh, yeah, and I'm going to pass everything okay, that you're trying to do. But look, look at you hands. Do you want the light squad to check you, ma'am? Yeah. Okay. Let them do what they got to do. Come on, boys. How you feeling? Hey, hey. <laughs> I want the little young boys. Ask me how I'm feeling. Let the little young boys oh, feel me. Boy. 
Uh -huh. Toon, she doesn't want you, man. <coughs> Who won't want me? Toon doesn't want. Who won't want me? I want you. You're good. You're cool with me, okay? You ain't got to want me. Want Let me tell you something. Uh -huh. What I would do to you with your blue eyes. Well, let me check your blood sugar okay. real quick. Hey, what is y'all doing to me out here tonight? Okay, huh? Ready? Here we go. Ready? Right here. That's it. What's your date of birth? May 28th, 1974. Here comes Jim and I. Look at you. You so damn handsome. Thank you. Landers. Landers. Yep, that's that's the last thing. Your ain't ready for me tonight. Oh, man, I don't think so either. Put, can I put a Band-Aid on you? Uh, you yeah. might as well bleed. Yeah, I'm going to put a Band-Aid on you. That would cost me to bleed. I didn't. He did. Look at you, Landers. Yeah. Hi, Landon. What's up? Uh, this theme continues as officers ask Barton to participate in field sobriety tests. Look at him. I would do him in a way that he won't eat me. <laughs> hey, look. He can look tough all he won't, right? Mm -hmm. Don't let me get him. Look at you. And you got Eyelashes like my son. They're pretty nice, aren't they? They are. Barton then begins to take a series of tests. All right, so Kelly, here's what I'm going to ask you. Do you have any neck injuries, head injuries, back injuries? Do you wear glasses or contacts? Have you been to the hospital recently for anything? Outstanding. What I'm going to do is I'm going to check your eyes, all right? What I need you to do is stand together, feet like together, this. arms to your side, OK? Yeah. Keep your arms to your side. Okay. All right. Just like this. All right. Like this. Perfect. And what I want you to do is you're going to follow the tip of this pen right here, okay? With yeah. your eyes and your eyes only, okay? Okay. She also mentioned that Barton was an employee at the Ohio Valley Residential Services Group home and was transporting a special needs patient at the time. The investigation confirmed Barton's involvement in the crash, and she faced charges, including operating a vehicle while impaired and neglect, given that she was responsible for the special needs patient's safety at the time of the incident. This was crazy for sure, but do not miss out on this one case three. On October 30th, 2022, in Northport, Sarasota County, Naomi Furrer caught the attention of law enforcement while driving a black Hyundai sedan. Exactly. But please take the DUI off, please, sir. The one arresting me, right? It, yes, I am the one arresting you, but everything we've done tonight is on video. I'll take everything off. I don't want you to take everything off. I Adam, promise Adam. I'll have somebody pick me up and drive me home, I promise. You don't want to go into jail like that. I really Calm don't down. want to be in this situation. No one wants to be in this situation. By not going, you're just going to make it worse. Pulling away and everything is another charge. Have what? you ever been in trouble before? Yeah. For what? I've been in a car where, like, there was apparently cocaine. At it's very clear you were at a Halloween party. Yes. I, I'm, well, there's yeah. no, there's no arguing. You. Can you not make an extension, please? I promise we're, I will never. A 10 and a $20 bill open container. We're past that. We're, we're past that. No one wants to go to jail. I wasn't trying to. I'm sorry. I wasn't trying to. Promise. I understand you weren't trying to, but you were. There's an open one there, and there's an open one in the garbage pail behind you. Fireball? Yeah. And then the tags expired in April, and her license is five times suspended. Yeah, that's how this How are you? Good. Yes. You got your driver's license on you? Yes, uh, I was just picking up my friend. Okay. Four, nine, four, I was just picking up my friend from North Port. Okay. Where are you headed to? Uh, I was just, I will. She lives in North Port. I was just trying to be, uh, <laughs> Thank you. You got your registration on chance for parking? Your fake cut had scared me when I walked up. Forgot tomorrow's Halloween. Pardon? I said your fake cut had scared me when I walked up. Oh. Forgot tomorrow's <laughs> Halloween. I'm like, oh I boy. I know, right? So, reason I got to stop, few things. When you're sitting at the light back here to make the left, yeah. you're all the way out in the intersection. Oh, okay. Like, you were past the crosswalk, but you were you were on Toledo Blade for making the left. Okay. Um, that, the tags on the car, is the car registered to you? Yes, sir. Okay, the tags on the car expired back in March. Yes, sir. Or April, I'm sorry. Um, and your license is suspended. Yes, sir. 
Did you know your license was suspended? I apologize about that. Okay. Um, you have insurance on the car? Yes, I do. Okay. Who's it for? Uh, it was uh, um, the uh, State Farm. Okay. Can you either pull it up on your phone or do you have a copy of it or anything in the car? Um, yeah, I can look it up. Maybe. Okay, that's fine. So you were on your way to pick her up? Yes, and I would have gone back to Sarasota. But... Okay. So where's the club wrist band from? Where's the club race? Oh, from? that was from the other night. That was from like Friday, I think, or something. Yeah. Gotcha. So work on your insurance. I'm gonna see why your license is no good. She was observed obstructing an intersection with outdated plates and a suspended license. Furr, allegedly intoxicated from a Halloween party, admitted to knowing about her suspended license. Following field sobriety exercises, her unsteady behavior raised suspicions of DUI and driving with a suspended license. Oh, it's complete. Okay. Can you just occupy this lane, please? All right, any questions? And um, could I do it without the shoes too, or no? Is this? Do you do you want to try it with the shoes or I just, without? I just I don't know. I just prefer it without because they're very crazy. Okay, yeah, so I just don't want you. If you if that. you want to take the shoes off, you can take the shoes off. Just be sure. Alright. So you still understand all the instructions to it? Okay. So go ahead and get back with your right foot in front of your left touching heel to toe. If you have no questions, you can go ahead and begin. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one, two, like that. How did how did I explain that? Uh, you, you turn like okay. That? Like turn like that. Yeah. Okay, you can turn back around. All right, let's just, you, you good. Sorry. You good. All right, actually, let's come right here. It's a little more level because it's a pretty good Sorry, side. yeah. Okay. Do you have any knee, ankle, hip problems, anything like that? Um, no, not at all. Okay. I just, I, yeah. Okay. Not so, this is just right here. I got you. Like we did on the first one, same with your feet and heels together. Yeah. Arms straight down to your side. Yeah. For this one, when I tell you to, you're going to pick either foot of your choosing, your left or your right. It's okay. completely up to you, whatever you feel more comfortable with. Okay. You're going to pick that foot up approximately six inches off the ground. Okay. It's about the height of a Coke can for reference. Okay? Yeah. And you're going to keep your toe pointed forward so okay. the bottom of your foot will be parallel to the ground. Okay? Yeah. You're going to look like, at... Like that or...? Like this. Okay. With your toe pointed forward. Okay? Yeah. You're going to look at the tip of your elevated foot and count out loud 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, and so on and so forth until I tell you to stop. Make sense so far? 1,000 from 1,000? Yeah, you're okay. 1,001, 1,002, okay. 1,000, until yeah. I tell you to stop, okay? okay? Yeah. It'll look like this. I'll demonstrate for you, okay? So your feet and heels are together. Yeah. When I tell you to begin, you're going to go 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, 1,004, 1,005, and so on and so forth. Make sense? Yes. Yeah. Okay. The whole time you're performing the exercise, remember to look at your feet or look at your foot. Count out loud in thousands. Leave your arms at your side. Make sure you leave both legs straight with your foot approximately six inches off the ground with your toe okay. pointed forward. Gotcha. Make sense? Yep. Okay, do you have any questions? No, sir. All right, if you have no questions, you can go, uh, give me one second, one second, one second, one second. All right, if you have no questions, you can go ahead and begin. 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, 1,004, 1,005, 1,006, 1,007, 1,008, 15, 1,016, 1,017, 1,018, 1,019, 1,020, 1,021, 1,022, 1,023, 1,024, 1,025, 1026, 1027, Arms straight down to your side. What's your highest level of education? Uh, I did a bachelor's degree in economics. Okay. So is it safe to assume you're familiar with the English alphabet from the letter A to Z? Yeah. Okay. Well, do you think when I when I tell you to, do you think you could recite the English alphabet from the letter A to Z in a non-rhythmic tone? So yeah. not singing the alphabet song, just saying A, B, C, yeah. D. Can you do that? Yeah. Okay. So, 
So with your feet and heels together, arms down to your side. I want you to tilt your head slightly back, close your eyes, and recite the alphabet from the letter A to Z. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Uh, XC, sorry. Okay. <laughs> I'm from Switzerland. I'm I got you. I'm sorry. <laughs> How long you been in America? Uh, for three years now. Okay. Did you come over like initially on a student visa and then stayed kind of? Uh, I have a green card. So. Okay. I got you. Uh, so staying with your feet and heels together. Yes. What I want you to do is put make a fist and bring your arms up like this. Point yep. your pointer fingers out. All right. Can we agree that this is the tip of your finger. Yep. This is the pad of your finger, this is the tip of your finger. Yep. Can we agree with that? Yes, sir. And then can we agree that this is the tip of your nose, this is the bridge of your nose, these are the sides of your nose, this is the top of your lip? Yep. So we're in agreement with the tip of your finger and tip of your nose are, correct? Yep. Okay. So leaving your arms like that, or your pointer fingers out, I just want you to hold your arms down your side. When I tell you to, I'm gonna tell you left or right. Whatever side I tell you, I want you to take the tip of that finger, touch the tip of your nose, and then bring it right back down okay. your side, okay? So if I say left, you'll take the tip of your then finger left. to tip of your nose, right back down your side, okay. right, tip of your finger, tip of your nose, right back down your side. Okay. Make sense? Yep. Okay, any questions about that? Despite the officer's attempts to handle the situation professionally, Fura resorted to pleading and later employing other tactics. My money and everything? It, do you have a purse, a small purse that I can put money in? Um. I, you can take a small bag, that's all makeup, I don't want to. I'm gonna, we'll take your phone and, and here, this bag's small enough. There's nothing in this bag, right? I have my phone over there. I'm gonna get your phone for you. That way you have it, okay? Sir, can you not make an exception, please? We're, I promise I would never. I'm sorry. So let's. I know, let's I on. understand come about on. the on. drinking come stuff, but. Come on, come on. What about my phone and my money? We're, we're gonna grab it. I'm getting everything for you, okay? Are you gonna pull up the window? Or yes, yeah, I'm gonna make sure. I'm not gonna leave your car here, okay? Your car is gonna be just fine. I'll put your watch in here too, okay? My money? Yes. I see the, the cash right here? Yeah. Uh, a 10 and a $20 bill. Open container. Red Bull phone. Okay, it's, we're past, we're, we're past that. No one wants to go to jail. I want to be mom or dad is here. Come on, come on, please. They're all in Switzerland, sir. I have nobody call when I get to the station. Okay. They will let you get numbers of friends and everything out of your phone. I don't have anybody. Please. You were just at a friend's house. You, yeah, but you I have don't to know, know people. the numbers. Well, you will be, any numbers you have in your phone, you'll be able to get out and get there. So please have a seat in the car. Sir, please. Please, I'm, I'm not going to ask you again. Please have a seat. I, I understand, but please, can you not make an exception? Please, I, I promise we're, I'll be We are past home. that. I need you to sit in the car. Well, what would I have to do? To Nothing. The only, the only thing that you could do to not go to jail tonight is not drive drunk. That's the only thing that would stop you from not going to jail. Is not driving. Home. I I wasn't trying to. I'm sorry. I wasn't trying to. Okay. I understand you weren't trying to, but you were. So. But I wasn't trying to be drunk at all. Okay. Please have a seat. And there's nothing in you, sir. No, ma'am. Fortunately, there's not. Even if somebody picks me up. Mm -mm. We're we're past that. Can you please put your knees in for the front? Thanks. Did she? Did you see her with a wallet or anything? No. What she was wearing, what she was wearing when she got out. No, I, I get that. Oh, yeah, she gave me her license. Uh, I don't see a wallet. We're just trying to make sure that we take stuff like that. There was some cash up front. I put that in that purse. Yeah. Did you call? For, there's a open one there, and there's an open one in the garbage pail behind you. <laughs> Fireball. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I called for town. Yeah, dude, um, I got gas and I was coming up. I was sitting. She was all the way over the stop bar, over the crosswalk. She was in the middle of Toledo Blade. Stop. Stop to make a left turn. And then the tags expired in April. And her license is five times suspended. Yeah. So let's send a Open the container. Open the container. I'm going to go through that mail. 
search of Furrer's car revealed open containers of alcohol. Consequently, she was arrested, refused a breath test, and was incarcerated in Sarasota County Prison. Additionally, her vehicle was towed away.